Yo, what's going on boys? I'm gonna be doing some ladder today. Finally back from Cali. It's been like, what, five, maybe six days. But yeah, it kind of sucks that my pre-recorded video's audio got messed up. Only one of them saved, so I was only able to upload one. And that kind of sucks too, because I spent like a whole night. I pulled an all-nighter before the day I had to go to Cali, because I wanted to pre-record a lot of videos. It sucks though, but all good. I'm gonna be pushing some ladder, and right now I'm kind of low because I haven't played ladder in six days. But yeah, just gonna try to get to like top 100 or something. If you enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. My goal is to get to 100k subs before the year ends. So I'd really appreciate it if you guys make it happen. But I'm gonna do a tiny story time on what happened in Cali. A lot of crazy stuff happened. It's kind of turning into Ohio, I'm not gonna lie. But looks like I'm facing RG. So yeah, a little bit backstory. Um, I went to... Oh, shoot. Bad timing on the valk in the back okay i'm gonna take a lot of damage it doesn't matter the bad matchup so i don't think i would have beat this anyways but <clears throat> sorry i'm just gonna get back to my story so anyways i went to cali to attend one of my cousin's wedding and kind of like catch up with people that i haven't met in six years um it was mostly kind of good but like the night before wedding we just kind of got everything done and like we went to bed pretty early went to bed at like 11 p.m because we had to get up at 5 a.m next morning to kind of get some more things done before the wedding but apparently at like 3 a.m i was asleep so like i didn't actually um see all this happen but at like 3 a.m my younger cousin got a text saying did you want to make this purchase at a gas station um with bad monk i'm gonna nato this back yeah i got a lock nice so he got a text saying did you want to make this purchase and he actually like got up he wasn't really that like alarmed about it he probably thought it was a glitch or something but over the span of like i don't know 10 to 15 minutes he got like a few more of those so he had to get up check his wallet and realize that he left his wallet in the car so he woke like some more people up he woke some relatives up that were kind of staying over at his place for the wedding but yeah they went outside to check the cars and apparently they saw this one guy kind of walking away from the cars in the parking lot and like apparently like four to five cars were kind of broken into um, my cousin, like, my younger cousin lost, like, a few things from the car that weren't really that valuable, but he also lost the wallet with, like, a lot of cards in it, so just kind of stayed up to, like, four deactivating all the cards and stuff, but, yeah, and the day after the wedding, one of the bus got hijacked in there, so, like, I don't know, California, I thought it was a pretty safe place, but I guess not. Going there just kind of made me realize how much I love, um, my state compared to California, but, I don't know, overall, I had a lot of fun, except for those um but gonna focus back in the game here i might be able to win this game i'm gonna um take some damage on the right side but since i already got like a hefty lock on the right i just might be able to win kind of a horrible matchup though he's got guards for the queen he's got a monk and he's also got an rg fireball kind of helps me out a little if he had a lightning i would have lost this game by now but since he's got a fireball he's not really being able to like get my tesla off the field right off the bat but that valk in the back in the beginning was kind of bad i'm gonna nato this back so when he pops the ability it goes back to his side so I don't really take any damage. That was a really good NATO. I've been NATOing the RG back. I don't know if you guys noticed because I was kind of talking through it. But yeah, I NATO the RG and the Monk back a lot. I'm just going to like go for an Ice Spirit on the Phoenix and just go for Tesla on it. But I'm going to make sure it flies up a little so like it doesn't get a hit on the Tesla. Kind of need it a lot for the RG. But anyways, kind of going ba back to what I was talking about. So it was kind of crazy to me how the cars got broken into because my area is complete different i have class like early in the morning like at 8 30 so i kind of wake up at like 8 just go to my car in the parking lot just turn my ac on and leave the car unlocked because my car is like pretty old i'm gonna nato this back hold on nice okay i just wanted the rg to go in front but yeah my car is kind of old so like you can't just lock it and like have the ac on at the same time like you can do with the new cars but yeah, I just turn it on, go to my room, get my stuff done, just get some breakfast and then like actually leave once I like get my car nice and warm. But in the city I was living in, in California, well, probably not just that city, like a few more cities, I guess. But yeah, over there, if you leave your car unlocked for like literally one minute, you get robbed. Okay, finally, the AC turned off, but I'm just going to go for a Valk and just log this back. I might choke because I need to play a second Tesla on this. And if it goes RG again with a Monk, I might be taking a lot of damage here, so... I'm gonna try to defend that the best I can. I'm gonna need this back. RG in front, maybe? Oh, no, okay, I kinda messed that up. And he's also gonna adapt him because he's not really popping the ability too soon. Um, but yeah, at this point, I just need to kinda defend. He popped the ability way too late on that, so I'm just gonna queen high, just go ability on this. He's probably gonna fireball it. Yeah, I had a feeling he would, so I'm just gonna Valk on this. And then if I had to guess RG again, oh, he goes opposite lane, so. I didn't see my towers at 2061 on the opposite lane as well. I'm gonna need all this. I was actually a really good NATO because I got the Fisherman as well. I'm just gonna like Valk over here. Uh, I'm not gonna log because the log is going to come back to me if he pops the ability. So I'm just gonna Queen on this and oh my goodness. Okay, I thought the tower was locked on the 
um, monk. That could have been bad if the tower was locked on the monk, because I would have taken a lot of damage. But since my tower was locked on the phoenix, I didn't really take like the few hundred damage that he would have gotten if he popped the ability on time. But yeah, really bad matchup. Not sure how I beat it. I was kind of talking through it, but I'll take it. 26. Okay, got a match. I had like a four minute wait time on top 400. This is kind of crazy, but I'm just going to Valk on defense here for the Barbaro. See what deck he's playing. Goes for Phoenix in the back, so I'm just going to have to like Queen the Bridge to uh, get the Phoenix out and hopefully force something out so I kind of know what deck he's playing. Okay, he's going to go ahead and Poison, so probably going to be like Splash Herd, but not really too sure. Could also be Minor Poison, who knows. I'm just going to pop my ability to kill the Egg. Kind of want to just go Axpo to, oh my god, don't do what I think you're going to do, and he actually does it. Just go Skelly King Graveyard. I mean, not a bad play, I guess, because I did suck in my Valk, but still, really annoying. Kind of a good Ice Spirit, because I got like three of the Skellies out, but now I'm just going to Axpo on the left here. Just try to go for like a Queen on the, what do you call it, the Phoenix, and yeah, get a Lock or something. Actually, he's probably not going to Phoenix. He's not back to it, plus like he's got an Ice Wiz and then Barbarrel to kill the Axpo, so... If I just go Expo here and kind of wait for the Barbarrel to catch it, just gonna Valk over here to catch it now. And then yeah, just kind of let the Ice Wiz do some damage on it for now, because I don't think it really matters. And I'm also pretty sure he's back to Skelly King, so I don't think I was going to get any damage to begin with, but I'll just try to get back to my second Expo and just go in. I'm gonna Queen High here to kill the Skelly King. Probably gonna pop the ability, not a bad ability. I think he wanted to get the Queen off the field, but I'm just gonna log this and yeah, the Queen is going to be undamaged. Well, one Skelly hit, but doesn't matter gonna pop my ability now to not let the queen take any more damage and the egg should die to my queen and the tower should also take some damage off of that queen he can't really ice was on it because if he does i just go expo again let the ice was lock on the tower and just go expo then you'd have to like let the expo lock on probably go for like a poison bar barrel but yeah he's playing smart so far so i'm just gonna expo and just go for like a valk to probably block the ice was i feel like that's a better player right now i'm not really too sure but let's see okay goes for ice was in the middle I guess he kind of knew I was going to Valk, so he just kind of played it in the middle. But I'm just going to log here. And wait, he kind of filled a kite on the Valk, so it got two hits. And he had to NATO that back, so not bad, I guess. I'm just going to, like, queen the back. Actually, no, I'm going to test on the middle. And then I'm going to queen the back, because he did just play a poison on the Axpo, so, like, he's not back to a queen. Or, wait, I meant to say poison, not queen. But he did play a phoenix in the back, so I'm just going to queen high here. Um, And he's, like, one-off poison, so I kind of wanted to queen high. He's back to it now, because he played a Skelly King on the queen, so I'm just going to rocket him here. And uh, pops the ability, so I'm gonna have to log this to get the egg out and not take any damage on that queen. Nice. Okay, does go for bar barrel, kind of a bad bar barrel. Um, I'm just gonna expo here because he played a bar barrel and he's like two off Skelly King. He might be back to Ice Fist, so I'm gonna Valk here. Never mind, he was only one off. Okay, champion cycle is kind of weird. Hard to keep track of cycle when there's a champion on the field, so that kind of sucks, but I'm just gonna Tesla here and yeah, should be fine now. Uh, just gonna log as well for the egg and the Ice Fist. Just go for a bar barrel, so that was actually a really good log there. Because if I didn't log, the egg would have popped. Okay, he's going to go ahead and stack up two tombstone. He got back to a poison, so he's actually going to play a poison on the queen there. But I'm just going to go for a nato on this and just go for like a Tessa on defense here. Just going to pop my ability because it's a really good ability. It's going to get the Skelly King out, so really good ability once again. And then I'm going to go for a... Okay, I was going to Valk on the Ice Wiz, but I don't really think I need to. Gonna Axpo again, just go log on the Skellies here and just go for okay. I'm not gonna Valk. I was going to Valk on the Bar Barrel, but that would have been a terrible Valk, so just gonna go for a Tesla, I guess, and then just gonna go for like a Valk once the um thing dies. Okay, wait, no, he goes inside. I'm gonna have to like Valk on defense here. Um, I'm kind of like second guessing myself and like not making the plays that I wanted to make initially because he's making a lot of good plays as well, so kind of have to watch out here. But goes for Phoenix again, so I'm just gonna Queen and then just go for ability here just goes for poison on the queen not bad i guess goes for bar barrel as well but the egg should die play the bar barrel like a second late so the egg died but i'm just gonna test a high here and just go for a x spawn defense um on the right side all the way on the right side here but before that i'm gonna have to play a valk here and just go for like a nato what was that bird um i think he meant to like let the skelly king tank for the tesla and then just go for like a bird on the tesla but he messed that up so i'm just gonna log over here and i got an x spawn defense so i don't really have to worry about the graveyard I'm just gonna like Valk anyways though, because I don't really want to take any RNG. Okay, no damage taken from that. That was really good. But I'm just gonna rock him here and he's yeah, just gonna log the egg out. Um, Skelly King is going to die to my Valk and the Expo. I'm back to a second Valk, so I can just kind of like drop it on the graveyard here, I guess. But yeah, overall, fine. Yeah, got his tower down to 1372, so I'm just gonna rocket him out here. Don't really have to get back to a second rocket. I'm just gonna like 
throw all my spells in hand and yeah that is going to be game so probably gonna play like three maybe four more this game should put me in like the top 200 hopefully i'm gonna check probably not but like i'm just gonna check i don't think so actually it might be like 250 or something but see how much i get 27 not bad okay oh uh, that is going to put me at 330 not bad okay got a match fishing chris see what deck he's playing i'm just gonna suck on my ice spirit and just kind of go for a log um if he doesn't do anything if he makes a play i'm probably gonna counter play but see what he does here okay looking like a beatdown deck he's not really making a play so i'm just gonna log him out and just go for like a queen in the back um okay he sh should like respond to this hopefully okay goes for a fireball not the best fireball he could have played but he probably has a monk deck so he's probably not gonna get punished for this but i'm just gonna expo here and just go for an ability like right now so the queen doesn't die oh that was a terrible ability all right yeah, he is going to pop the ability kill my expo and bomb tower to make sure my expo dies but the thing is if i outcycle the monk right now i'll be fine so see what he does if he's smart he's not going to play a card before the monk dies i'm just going to valk over here and yeah he's playing good if he played the minor like before the monk died he would have um messed up his cycle and like would not have gotten the monk back sooner but since he played it now like in the back to defend the valk he might be able to get it back soon i'm gonna play my ice spirit in the back and just go for a log okay see what he does here i kind of want to like outcycle the monk but at the same time he might be back to it thing is i can kind of nato it away but once he figures out i have a nato he's always going to monk at the bridge so like i did versus the rg player i kind of have to monk like below the tower or like behind the tower i guess to get a lock i'm just gonna do it now just go expo here and he might try to go for like a monk in the middle because i do have a queen opposite lane okay what was that monk not going to defend the queen so i'm just gonna pop my ability i actually kind of mistimed the ability there but i get the elixir back for that so i'm good okay i don't know what the ability was supposed to be but it wasn't really like lining up to the tower so you kind of like wasted that ability kind of a funny ability but i see the thought process though like i see what he was trying to do there but probably panicked or he meant to like deflect but i don't know if he meant to deflect that was stupid i just want to be nice and say he kind of like panic popped it so i'm gonna ice spirit on the minor and just go for a valk on it actually nah i don't need a valk i'm just gonna rock it here i gotta like rock in that tower two more times so i just kind of had to eat the minor because i do have a lot of hp i can spare right now so i'm just gonna like log this out that way the egg doesn't pop and the wall breakers also die and i'm like two off rocket right now okay he's got a magic archer what that's news to me because i had no idea he had a magic archer so gonna tesla here just go for an ice spirit and that should die i'm just gonna rocket him here and hopefully he doesn't like rocket block me okay just go for a monk high um i don't really know how to activate king with the wall breaker so i'm just gonna play this safe log is going to come back and hit me but he might just go fireball on the what do you call it the queen and then go for a minor if he does i'm gonna pop my ability but he actually went for a fireball at the bridge so i'm just gonna go for like a ability right here and he actually goes for nato that nato was kind of good because it got my ice spirit away from the minor plus killed the um what do you call it the queen but i'm just gonna have to get back to a rocket and that is going to be game so really easy game here just gonna nato this back and yeah just gonna rocket on the tower he can't deflect this because the monk is on my side obviously so yeah really good game there probably not gonna get much this guy's kind of low compared to me so see how much i got 32 what kick okay, out a match facing paul see what deck he's playing i'm just gonna queen them back to cycle and i don't really know if it's a good play anymore because well it used to be a good play but now that monk is actually a thing this might not be a good play just go for a monk in the back had a feeling he was playing it because every single game always face monk and phoenix but uh see what he does here probably going to pop the ability to kill my queen i'm just gonna valk over here did the valk tank i'm not really too sure if it did nah okay never mind um two of the zappies locked on the queen so i can't really pop my ability but i'm just gonna tesla here and just go for a log i guess do i really have to log though no i don't think so i'm just gonna like ice spirit over here and yeah that is going to be good defense on that <coughs> sorry so to get a lock in this matchup i kind of have to nato the monk away but it's not really that easy because a lot of times they just don't kind of play the monk low they just kind of play higher like all the way up high at the bridge so i'm gonna try to get him to kind of play a monk low by probably playing a queen opposite lane so that he has to kind of play it in the middle um it's kind of why i went queen low but he actually played a poison so gonna have to pop my ability i am still going to axe on the left here i know he's back to monk but i kind of have to to be able to out cycle it i gotta get it out first so that's what i'm gonna do just gonna get it out of cycle and just gonna valk over here nice okay beautiful valk because i should block the barbarrel too and he popped the ability before it got the pushing shot off so valk is going to like bait something else out 
Not that it would have really mattered, I think, but if that didn't happen, he probably didn't have to, like, play the Zappies. I'm just gonna log the Zappies out, and my food's almost here, so I'm gonna try to get this game over soon, but just gonna have to queen them back. I'm kind of hopeless in this, because I don't know how to get a lock. When they have Zappies, it's, like, almost impossible, but if they have an Ice Wiz, it's kind of, like, possible to get a lock sometimes. Because with Ice Wiz, you can actually kind of, like, outcycle stuff in single, just because they have a Nato, Barbaro poison and graveyard like four spells so if you kind of get them into like an awkward cycle you can definitely get a lock but this matchup like it's impossible to get them into an awkward cycle so i'm just gonna expo here and just go for a valk to kind of block the ice Wiz. actually no he doesn't have ice Wiz. what am i talking about he's got a zappy so gonna have the valk here and yeah just gonna go for an ice spirit can't even lock because the lock comes back to my side this is so annoying just gonna go um tesla in the middle He's probably going to go in. If he does, he gets guaranteed damage. So that kind of sucks. But I'm just going to log on the left here to get the Goblin Gang out. And then just go for a Queen High. Like all the way over here. So can't really poison the Queen out anymore. Uh, what? How is that? Like, okay, whatever. Probably should have spammed it all the way up high. But the Queen still got hit by the poison. So that's really annoying. Um, does go for a Barbarrel. So the Queen is going to die. But I'm just going to Ice Spirit over here. Just go Valk at the bridge to block the monk at the bridge and just go tesla low because that's my only option i don't have an e-spirit in the deck or like anything that actually defends the actual graveyard so just gonna have to take some damage here gonna go for an ice spirit just pop my ability to kill the egg out and just go for like i was going to go for expo but i don't have enough elixir i'm just gonna do it now though i'm just gonna go expo and he predicted max bow nice this is not very good gonna nato these and then just go for a log on these so i get like a tiny lock hopefully he does have a Goblin Gang, so might not be able to get a lock. Yeah, this is really annoying, but I just need that one tiny lock. Like, I just need one lock so I can defend it with my life. That was a really terrible placement on the Graveyard, by the way. I can just kind of Valk and full counter it. Kind of wanted to play the Ice Spirit to make sure I wouldn't take any damage. I took one Skelly hit. That's why I kind of played the Ice Spirit on the inside to deny the RNG, but didn't really work out because the Ice Spirit jumped on the other Skelly, so that kind of sucks. Hard to explain the RNG, but you get the point gonna log here and okay the queen did not die so i'm just gonna rock it here i'll be back to the second rocket in no time i'm just gonna pop my ability nice okay so he's gotta play like a monk on that never mind he does not play a monk on it just go for a tombstone on it so not bad i guess i'm gonna go for a valk here just go for like a log and make sure okay i could have like activated my king but like that would have been really awkward because i needed the log on defense here to kill the skelly so kind of had to but yeah i'm pretty sure i lost the game like i can't come back from this but Worth a shot, just gonna rock it, just gonna go for a queen high. Like, all the way up high so he can't poison me out anymore. He might be back to, what do you call it, monks. It might play the monk on the right side. I'm gonna log this out, and just gonna nato the goblin gang. Please tell me that's a lock. Wait, he played a zappies on the other side. Oh my god, wait, he choked. Oh my goodness, okay, that felt really nice, because I couldn't do anything that whole game. Except for at the end, he kind of made a misplay there. He played zappies on the right side to kill the queen. And yeah, just got my order. So I'm just gonna go get some food and then be back in like, I don't know, 10 minutes or something. Get back on ladder. But yeah, see where that puts me. Top 260. Not bad. Okay, got a match. Facing USO Anthony. See what deck he's playing. I'm just gonna lock the cycle. This guy's actually a lot lower than me. So gonna have to watch out. I don't wanna lose this game and lose like 50 trophies. So just gonna queen the back here. But yeah, log first play, a really safe play now. Even safer than back in the day like back like two months ago because you kind of had to worry about the deck being log bait um two months ago but since bait died like a month ago or something you don't really have to worry about it i don't think i worded that right but you get the point like log bait's dead so like you can just kind of log anytime you want i'm just gonna ask on the left side here with the tesla just wanted to make sure he wouldn't like buller into it but he's playing um lumber loon freeze so it's a really good matchup I'm gonna nano this in and yeah the tesla should take care of it I'm gonna log here. Okay, I'm gonna take a lot of damage. Yeah, he goes for Barbara Hill, so the Lumberjack is actually going to push it into my tower, and I can't really Valk on it, so I'm gonna have to eat that. Kind of a, I don't know, like, miscalculation, I guess, because I thought it was going to Baby Dragon on that, so I kind of played an Ice Spirit, but it died to the Lumberjack, and he also played a Barbara Hill, so I wasn't really able to Valk on it, and then took a lot of damage. I should be able to come back from this, though, just because I have a really good matchup on this um but if he goes for freeze right now he might get my whole tower so i'm gonna have to get the tessa ready um never mind he's not going to do so so he's not back to bowler right now if i just go expo i get the tower i think he's got to go for a eye drag and then get back to a bowler and just go freeze on the expo to not let it 
lock on the tower or kind of like make a hop off the tower I guess but I'm just gonna Tesla here because the bowler is on the queen and I was going to lock on the Tesla so he's got to go for like a freeze on this nice yeah does go for freeze um I'm not sure if I need to like NATO this or log this probably could have logged but yeah he played a bar barrel so it doesn't matter um I'm just gonna go for a log on the bowler just eat that one hit from the bar barrel I don't really mind the one hit I just wanted the damage on the tower so Gonna Ice Spirit, and the Ice Spirit is also going to get some damage. If he goes Lumber Loon, I kind of have to, like, Rocket Nato right now. Because if I just go Rocket, I might be able to, like, only hit the Balloon or the Lumberjack, so. Okay, never mind. Um, I'm back to Tesla, so I'm just gonna do this and just go for a Tesla really high here, so he can't really freeze. And if he does go for a freeze, I kind of have to Nato, so. Yeah, kind of had options there. I'll be fine, though. Just gonna Rocket, actually. Would that be a good Rocket? Yeah, whatever. I don't really know if that's a good rocket, but I just want to get the bowler off the field. So I just kind of rocketed the bowler, and the queen got like a few hits on it, so the bowler died. I'm gonna log here and just try to get back to my Tesla. I know it's going to go in because I just rocketed the bowler for no reason. So it's gonna Valk over here to pull everything in the middle. He might go for a freeze. He's definitely going to go for a freeze, actually. Yeah, okay. The tower should lock on the eye drag. Um, so I'm gonna NATO this into my king. Kind of have to. If I miss that NATO, I'll lose the game. Okay. Thought I missed for a second, but I'll be fine. Just gonna Ice Spirit, just go for a Queen in the back again. On the corner here, not in the back, because you might be able to NATO the opposite lane. Or predict it. Sometimes they kind of go for like prediction NATO on the Queen when you play it in the back. And when they go opposite lane, when the Queen goes opposite lane, you just kind of lose the game because you can't defend at that point. But I'm just gonna pop my ability. Nice, the E Drag died, or the I Drag died, so it's not really gonna be able to kill my Queen. Just gotta go for like two more rockets and like two logs and a NATO, I think. Or like two NATOs and a log. Um, but either way, I'm pretty close to winning the game, so I'm just gonna Valk here. Uh, I don't know why I popped the ability, I kind of just panic popped it, but yeah, the queen died. Just gonna go for a Tesla, just go for an Expo soon. Okay, never mind. Just go for an Ice Spirit, or what do you call it? Idrax. So I gotta go for Ice Spirit, just go for a NATO here to not let that kill my Tesla. Pretty good NATO, I got the E Drag as well, so I'm gonna pop my ability on that queen to kill the E Drag, and then just go for a Valk uh, over here. Oh, he's back to Bowler. Kind of a bad Valk. I thought he was like one off bowler, but he's back to bowler. Kind of realized it when he like didn't play anything for a good two seconds that he was going to get a really good bowler on that. That's all good though. Um, just got to defend this one push and then I can go for like double rocket on the tower. So I'm just going to rocket him here. Go for an ice spirit and the ice spirit is going to die. Just going to have to Valk in the middle and just go for a queen over here so that he doesn't get a really good freeze or a NATO on it. He actually tried to NATO that end of his tower. That's a funny NATO, but I'm just going to NATO this back. And yeah, that is going to die. So he's probably going to freeze on the Tesla and the... What? Okay, he actually missed. So I'm just going to rocket log him and just go for a second rocket. I think he meant to like freeze the king, the Tesla, and the tower, but he missed. So I'm just going to Tesla again. Just go for a Valk. Go for an Ice Spirit. I'm back to um, rocket, so I'm just going to rocket him out. And that is going to be game. So I'm just going to end the video there. Um, let me see where that puts me, though. But yeah, this game should give me like, I don't know, 15 or something. 17 yeah whatever i'll take it okay and that puts me at 2651 so top 234 not bad if you enjoyed the video please make sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next video bye